Hi everyone, my name is Raziel Kane and I'm back with another Toy Hacks review and today this guy is not gonna need a force field, he's gonna need stickers and those windows look pretty sick. So that's the main reason why I get decals is because of the windows. Like if Toy Hacks would say here pay $200 and have windows for all of uh, the mainline figures, just the windows, I'll buy it. So you know, something to think about Toy Hacks. That's a quick 200 bucks and uh so yeah just check out uh <laughs> well, guys don't forget to check out my sponsor djc collectibles fantastic online store and wait until the end of the video you can get your 10 percent discount code for anything transformers and also check out my voice acting playlist the main feature of my channel something i'm very proud of and now let's get trailbreaker to the paint shop It sure beats walking. Now taking a look at Mr. Forcefield before I apply the decals. Well, let's do decals first. Uh, great cellophane thing. Uh, he came with uh, extra logos, which I stored away already. Uh, big silver Autobot logos. Uh, looks like it's gonna be fun and nice for the windows. And there's eye decals. So I guess there's two. I can go red or blue. I'm gonna go blue. Looks like there's extras as well. And then you have all these details on foil backing that are going to be added to uh, Trailbreaker. And then you have some nice pin covers here. Uh, yeah, so this looks like to be a part of the leg. I don't know. We'll see. And it's I'm sure it's going to look good. And then I love this figure. I hunted him down across a couple uh, stores back then. And finally, uh, a gentleman at uh, EB Games, who is now GameStop Canada, uh, helped me uh, find one uh, in the area so I was really happy and I thought it was a hair but it looks like a paint scratch anyway uh, I love the face sculpt I mean I can hear Frank Welker and uh, the uh, I love the gun I love the details not much in paint you have like red plastic gray plastic and the, that dark green brown and then you have the Autobot logo it looks really good the eyes are fantastic and then you have some details here here you know it looks okay it looks good so that's gonna be fun to uh, to apply, and uh, he's gonna look. Um, I know he's gonna look fantastic. So uh, stay tuned. Frank here wants to know how we transform, Hound. And now I'm back from toy hacking and uh, warming up the figure afterwards uh, to make sure that the uh, eye decals and the force field emitter decals really stick uh, well, and uh, also for the legs. Toy hacks even recommend. Uh, Heat up the figure afterwards. It's just uh, have everything you know fit uh, smoothly. What's left is uh, three eye decals or visor decals. Uh, you have blue and red, and here you got license plate. So if you bought Trailbreaker when they lost the right to it, when he was called Trailcutter and Trailblazer or T-Bone, I don't know. You can have decals for that. So yeah, it's pretty cool. And I have leftover as a force filament or uh, decals. So. That's it uh, for leftovers. Uh, taking a look at Trailbreaker, he looks really good. There's a lot more decals uh, on the robot mode than there is on the alt mode. So, like I said, visor looks really good. You have three little uh, golden dots on the force field emitter. You have pin covers here and here, but th there's actually a design to it. Uh, and it looks really good. Uh, you have uh, those decals here and here. Uh, no Autobot logo. You have a little red light, but that's going to show more in uh, uh, alt mode. You have this decal here for the the, uh, the crotch area, and then you have an, an enhancement for the upper thigh, the knee, and the toe. And oh, for the forearm as well, and this blue decal here uh, for the upper arm. So looks really good. And the rest will pop more in alt mode. So we'll do that. So now final look before I show you uh, Trail break Breaker with the decals. Maybe I still have enough power left to shield us from this killer rain. And now to take a look at Trail Breaker before I apply the decals. It's a fantastic mold. 
I love the alt mode here. Sure, the hands are sticking out, but where else is he gonna put them, you know? So no, it, I love it. I I love the uh, the cab. I love the fact I you know I realized I mistransformed him because the tools that go over his shoulders were still inside, and uh, maybe the gun placement is kind of a little weird on top of it like that. But you could say it's his force field generator. Um, I love you know logo. The the front end looks really good. Can't wait to see if Toy Axe does something for that. Uh, painted details. I mean this is an 80 struck it's uh it's it's it it is uh four wheel drive of course always four wheel drive and uh of course the down you know downside is this it's uh you know robotish but love this out mode so now let's take a look at him after the paint job i'm really feeling better like i just stepped off the assembly line and now trail breaker in alt mode he looks really good i like this look I mean, you have a little enhancement here with the uh, uh, the red. Looks pretty good. You know, the end is still showing. Okay, this. I don't know if you guys are seeing it. It's a little more reflective. Reason is, there's a decal here and here, which are uh, chromed or reflective silver. And basically this, you glue on the inside and it's supposed to give a more reflective look to the windows, more realistic look. I, you know what? I think it works. Now that I'm seeing it on camera, yeah, it it it, it looks better. I mean, it's subtle, but it looks better. Uh, this is uh, you know decal for here for the side and also uh, the window in the back, and then you have a little uh, window on top here on the canopy, and then in the back. Looks really good. Trail breaker right here. Tail lights. Uh, this is standard with the figure. Uh, nothing for the cannon, so didn't put it there for no reason. And is that it? Yeah. yeah, well, this translates from robot mode. So yeah, I guess I'm done. So fantastic set. I mean, I love the windows and I'm not disappointed with this set at all. It's fantastic. Well, thanks for watching, guys. I hope you've enjoyed this review. If you did, please like, subscribe, and hit the bell. Also, leave a comment. I love reading those. Keep coming back. I have more on the way. And remember, nothing in life gives you a right to be an asshole. Take care.